Hello everyone, Asperin here doing another review. Um, I already did some next mutation finally with the, with the Dragon Lawyer Soldier Venus and uh, another Venus, the uh, Trash and Don Tello, the original, v uh, I ever say that, an original Michelangelo, which it needs a newer belt. However, since I got this here, the original Raphael Leonardo in good condition because you know I bought him exactly like that. I never miss up my toy. Alright, so this is going to be a re review for you soon. Um, like I said before, if you need a place to find some cool toys, check them out, check them out, check them out. Fire Corner, here's the first story right there. Underneath it, the second story they came up with. And now we got the Fire Corner's Facebook, and they got their old phone number. Check them out. Okay, pause if you have to. Okay, let me put this over here. Alright, so here's Raphael, Mutation Raphael. I am more of a big fan of the toys than I am with them, than the show. That's just me. I blame Venus for it. <laughs> I like the fact of how the headband is all cut up, like the, you know, it's raggedy, which is really cool to me. Uh, it does it does have that feel like like the whole movie star um, rubber feel to the body. And they all have that head strap right there with their buckle right there, the initials. As you see, and of course, that's where the uh, Turtles 12, 2012 version got the idea from, is these guys with their, um, like, band and everything. I am a fan of the show. I do like the show, how they came up with that. However, focus, 1997, Morgan Studio Playmates Toys, and I think he's pretty cute. Uh, yeah, also, I forgot to mention, uh, his movements, actually, his arms can actually go out, bend a little bit, back down, back, forward, same with the leg, and the head moves, of course, I just showed you on that. Wish I could find his weapons, but that was the years back. Leonardo, I like his, uh, headband, too, as you can see, his, uh, initials on top, a lot, a little more hot topper. Every belt is different, actually, if you really think about it, and, uh, of course, they're a little... We are looking shell. I don't know how to explain the shell part. But, uh... Same thing. The movements is really easy to do. Very rubberly. As you can see, you can bend it. It's just like the movie Star Turtles. The back shell and everything. Actually, so we're still playing with toys. See, why can't they just do that, you know, just, like, just paint it over that thing instead of, like, the pretending it is Turtle Toys from 2012. Uh, I do like the painting, though. I like the, how they put it all together. But, like I said, not a big fan of the, of the show. So, now I just need to find regular Dontello. Of course, all their weapons. I already got the Venus, and I already got my Glenn, so... I don't, I don't know. Short review, like I said, I have no idea what else to say, but, till next time, people, I mean, seriously, add a question, if you're not a big fan of new Next Mutation, that's okay, the toys are fantastic, um, like I said, the only thing that ruined it for me, wasn't the acting, wasn't anything else, it was just Venus turning Shredder into a good guy, like, oh no, how did I pick him this, it's like, Turtles been fighting him for so many years, and it just took one little magic from Venus, and that was it. And I was not a big fan of Shredder costume or the Fist Soldiers. But that's just me. I mean, I still will able to. I will still watch the show no matter what. Alright, people. Um, put your comments down. What do you guys think about these? Were you a big fan? Do you like the show better than toys? Do you like the toys better than the show? I mean, tell me anything you want. Share your, your childhood with it. So, uh, yeah. Uh, soon I will add on more uh, reviews of evil villains, EA ones. Got a lot more to review, people. So take care of yourself, and happy hunting, everyone. See you later.